morning guys happy Thursday um, I was really excited about getting my Galaxy Yeti cup but then I realized there is a crack that is running all the way to here like past the middle of the cup so I'm a little disappointed in that I let them know about it hopefully they'll replace it or something I don't know I know you can buy replacement lids but again with the way they packaged it mm. if you saw my video yesterday you know I was complaining about it um, I do believe, tomorrow is weigh-in, I do believe that I am up this week, and I do believe it is stress-induced. Um, Sunday, I basically had a breakdown, and, uh, I've been trying to recover ever since, but... I mean, it just is going to be the way it is. I have stress. There is no way to relieve it. I have tried. Um, but, I mean, I do. I am relieved now that I found out some of the information about my son. So, that's made thing. I mean, it, like, took 300 pounds off of my shoulders. Um, and I feel so much better about that. Um, and also, with guardianship, you have to, like, keep books on your child's money. And it's like, I have a hard enough time thinking, because I know I, they still make you do it, though, with um, Social Security, but you have to charge your child rent. And it's like, how much do you charge your child for rent? I don't know. It's just, I mean, I wouldn't charge any of my other children rent. I mean, do I want them still living with me when they're, you know, 19, 18? No. Well, they don't actually graduate until they're 19, but because of their birthdays, but no, not really. Um, I know that sounds bad. <laughs> Let's just say we are going through the teenager years, and it is not, has not been pleasant, um, along with the seven year old and the handicapped 17 year old. Um, it could be worse though. Uh, having rocket, not rocket, I was reading the keto book. She has rocket fuel lattes. This is a bulletproof coffee. I do have butter. I have MCT oil and two tablespoons of heavy cream and some sugar-free vanilla. Oh, and the picture, the first picture was my coffee pods for my Keurig. It's so cute. And they have like different roasts and stuff and there's like an owl and I don't know probably a cat or something I don't know I just I want for I wanted the vanilla one though but they have a whole bunch of cute ones and they're actually decent price they're like $4.99 even not on sale so and you get 12 instead of 10 and I like the mesh bottoms better than I like the whole plastic bottoms but anyways it's beside the point um have my day all tracked out Again, I think I'm up, but again, I think it's stress-induced and because it's definitely not over what I ate this week, but it is what it is and I'm not going to stress about it because it's not worth adding another stress to my life <laughs> right now. I mean, yeah, if it's in three months and I'm still up, then yeah, we'll have some issues and try to adjust things, but right now I'm just not going to stress about it. crack is driving me nuts. Because um, you can actually suck air through it. Um, oh, and the other picture is <laughs> basically because I didn't want to go out and eat anything because I felt so relieved that um, about my son's situation. Sorry for the bumps. We're on the highway. Highway stinks. Um, I didn't want to go out and eat, <laughs> so I went to go see the cats at the pet store and ended up buying my son a hamster. Mm -hmm. His name is Bootsy. I named him because I have learned a couple of things in life, at least with my children. You do not ask them to pick out an animal because it'll stand there for two hours. You do not let them name it because its name will change 500 million times before the next day comes. So, I named it Bootsy and told him his name is Bootsy. 
and it comes, if anybody remembers 80s movies, Savannah Smiles. I loved that movie. I don't know why, because it was such a cheesy movie, but they do have it on YouTube if you look it up, Savannah Smiles. And basically two guys, well, one guy breaks another guy out of jail, and then they accidentally kidnap this rich kid. She actually crawls in their car, and they didn't really kidnap her, but and then they try to take care of her, and then they try to get money, and it's just, anyways, the little girl ends up calling the bigger guy Bootsy. So, <laughs> I, that's why I called him Bootsy, I guess, I don't know. But anyways, um, I am at Walmart again. I have to get a few things for the hamster. Um, cat food, I don't remember, I've got a list, and if I didn't have a list, I wouldn't know what the heck I was here for. Um, I might see if they have a Ozark lid that fits this thing, too, because this lid issue is really peeving me. But I'm hoping maybe with a bigger coffee, I mean, I need coffee, people. I need coffee, y'all. I love Starbucks cups, but they're like 12 ounces. That's not coffee. Um, not that I've had a real big problem staying satiated, but I'm hoping with 30 ounces of coffee. <laughs> because I use the same pod twice. I do 12 and then I do 8. And then with everything else mixed in, it pretty much fills it up. So, oh, oh, and I do have collagen in here today. Because I needed like the extra 10 grams of protein. Okay, so I will shut, and lunch and dinner are really not that exciting because I don't have any meat that I want to eat, so it's basically hard-boiled eggs. I know I'll eventually get tired of them, but right now they're working, so I'm happy with it. Okay, I was super starving today. I mean, this is what I was planning on eating, but I'm eating it exactly like at noon because I was so hungry. Um, three ounces of cheese. I'm not crazy about that cheese. I thought it was Dill Havarti. It is not. It's some kind of garden something or other. But I paid a lot of money for it, so I'm going to eat it. Um, and two hard-boiled eggs with salt and pepper. Um, good news, the person is going to send me a replacement lid. But they blamed it on the USPS for breaking it. And I was like, well, maybe you should have packaged it a little bit better. But anyways. So that is the news on that. And I did order a second lid just in case from Amazon. And it should be here on Friday. Okay, so my son had um, soccer practice and my husband's working late again, so I did not feel like cooking. So we got Taco Bell. No idea how many calories are in here. I got double steak, pico de gallo, guacamole, ranch, cheese, lettuce. No beans, no rice. So that is going to be dinner. Oh, and I also still have a raspberry power crunch bar to eat. This is probably not the best dinner considering weigh-in is tomorrow, but I really don't care right now. And if I do gain, it's going to be water weight anyways from the salt. 